what was it like before we had the quilt house when you did an exhibition? Well, it was a lot of fun because what we would do is we, every summer, we would have an exhibition in the Robert Hilstead Textile Gallery. Um, and we would often work with other museums on campus in order to put together a, a quilt exhibition. But, you know, it was also really difficult because we didn't have our own space in which to do these quilt exhibitions. So, you know, it was, it was really gratifying to work with these other organizations, but also difficult. So, in 2008, when we got Quilt House, things changed dramatically, as you know, because that's when you came on board to help us with exhibitions. So, so it was a whole new world. And then we had to learn how to do museum. It was. It was a whole new world of having to do museum work yeah. that uh, we didn't have a lot of experience with. Like, who had the crazy idea that we could change an exhibition in four days? Well, we're not going to lay any blame on any single doorstep, but yeah, yeah. Who thought of that? But it has turned out, hasn't it? Right. We learned how to do it. We learned how to do it. And now our visitors get to see an exhibition very soon after we right. started installing. Right. And the space is great. The space is fantastic. Those galleries are just perfect for our quilt. You know what really pulled it all together for me so it could really be a museum? Hmm. So many things could be the thing, but what is it? Let me stand up and show you. Okay. Oh, Carpenter's oh. tool apron. <laughs> I, I, I see it. That brings it all together, doesn't it? Yeah. And the staple gun. 